Hey guys, Lauren Bateman here. Welcome back. In this video lesson, we're gonna be doing a very, very simple little intro riff um, that you can hear in the Temptation song, My Girl. As usual, don't forget to like and comment on the video below. And uh, you can always go to my website to find the tab for this little intro. So all we're gonna do is it's a very, very simple little lick here. And we're both mainly gonna be using our first finger and our third finger. We're kind of almost following a little bit as if we were gonna play like a pentatonic scale. So what we're doing is we're starting on the third fret of the fifth string. So third fret, fifth string. This is a C note, okay? Cause we're playing over a C chord. So a C note, third fret, fifth string, and we're gonna slide it up to the fifth fret of the fifth string. So it's third fret, and then we're gonna move our whole, so we're playing with our first finger, we're gonna slide the whole thing up to the fifth fret. So three to five, and then the third finger is gonna play the seventh fret. So all in the same string, we've got three, first finger slides up to the fifth fret, and the seventh fret. So we got three, five, seven, three, five, seven. So there you go. After that, we're gonna just play on the string below. So fourth string, we're gonna go third fret, fifth fret. Same thing, third fret, fifth fret, followed by the third fret on the third string. So basically, if we go back to the fifth string, and I'll go in for a close up for you guys to see, we have third fret, fifth fret, seventh fret. This is all in the fifth string. And then we're gonna move down one string, fourth, fourth string, fifth fret, followed by the seventh fret. And then one more time with the first finger, move it down one more to the fifth fret on that G string. So we've got, again, That is that first little lick. Let me show you guys in on a close up a little more. Okay, just so you can see a little closer what I'm doing. We have the first finger on the third fret, fifth string, fifth fret, seventh fret, all in the same fifth string. Move the finger down one string to the fifth fret. Third finger plays the seventh fret. And then first finger moves down again, one string on that fifth fret G string. So here it is. So it's three, five, seven, five, seven, five. Three, five, seven, five, seven, five. And here's the timing. So that's what we're playing over our C chord. Let's go and see what we're gonna play over the F chord, which is exactly the same pattern. We're just starting in a different spot. So we're gonna take our first finger again. We're gonna put it on the top string first fret. It's an F note, so that, this gets played over an F chord. So we have F, and we're gonna do the same thing. We're gonna slide up to the third fret on the top string, and we're gonna go three, five. So it went one, three, five. Now following the same pattern, we're gonna move our first finger down to the fifth string third fret, third finger on the fifth fret. And then the first finger is gonna move down one more time, third fret on the fourth string. So we've got one, three, five, three, five, three. One, three, five, three, five, three. Okay, one more time, one, three, five, three, five, three. So it's the same exact shape we were doing over on the C chord, or what we would be playing over a C chord, except we're starting on an F note as opposed to a C note. So let me go in for a close up again, just so you can see exactly what my fingers are doing. All right, here we are again. First finger, first fret, top string. First finger slides up to the third fret, and then third finger plays the fifth fret. So we got one, three, five. 
first finger moves down one string, third fret, and the third playing finger plays the fifth fret on the same string. And then first finger moves down one more string, fourth string, third fret. So here it is. So there you have it. You can see that the first finger and the third finger are doing all of the work. So let's talk a little bit about the picking now that we're doing with our right hand. So the picking pattern I'm using is down, up, down, down, up, down, down, up, down, down, up, down. So it's Okay, so here I am on my close-up, and you're gonna watch my hand. So it's first one, down, up, down, down, up, down. Second one, down, up, down, down, up, down. First one, down, up, down, down, up, down. Second one, down, up, down, down, up, down. Now the typical rule for alternate picking is that when you are playing on the same string, you alternate the picking pattern, down, up, down, up. And that's what we're doing on the first section, down, up, down, or down, up, down. And then we're gonna move down because we're going down the strings. So basically the picking follows um, the motion. So you do alternate picking on the same string, and then when you switch strings, whether you're moving up or down, that's usually the picking pattern that you would follow with. So if you're moving down, you would start with a down pick. If you're moving up, you would start with an up pick. Just some picking technique for you guys to know. So there you have it. That's this lesson on the little lick from My Girl. Make sure to leave a like and a comment below this video. Don't forget to subscribe. And if you found this video helpful, go to laurenbateman.com backslash donate. I really appreciate all the donations that you guys make. I do put a lot of time and effort into these videos. And we'll see you guys in the next lesson video. Oh,